Hello, everybody. It's Ed Rosenberg, and I'm speaking to Max from Ecom Tentative. Max, how are you doing? Good. Good to see you, Ed. Good to see you again after New York in January. Yeah, so you came at the event, um, reminisced of some great times, and hopefully January we'll do the next one again. Um, you used to work for Amazon, and you have a fascinating product. You want to mm -hmm. tell me a little bit how you got involved into AI for images? Sure. So um, as you mentioned, I, I was working for Amazon for six years. And back in September 2022, my now co-founder basically showed, this is before ChatGPT launched, he showed me um, Stable Diffusion, which had just gone live. And this is the first time a like a, a, a generative AI model went public. And it was, you could download it on like two gigabytes and have it on your phone. And he showed me this and pretty quickly, like my, my imagine, you know, working at Amazon, my, my imagination was going like 99% of content on marketplaces is going to be AI generated in, in a few years. Like the technology is so powerful, um, like so visually appealing, so quick. And, and really we got started from there. And, and the other thing that really drew, drew me to it was that we kind of start, you know, we, a month before we started, it wasn't possible to do what we're doing. And then like suddenly it was. So we really were at the start of this, this race and kind of, I felt that it didn't matter how big someone else's team was or another company. Like we've got a great team. We're small. We're like seven or eight people in the company, but like we're, we're nimble and, you know, we have a fair shot at kind of really building the best product for Amazon sellers given like we started at, you know, at the, at the same time as anyone else could. Right, so you you describe what you do. Basically, you take a product and, because I remember I used to get lifestyle images. What I used to do is I'd go on Craigslist or something and I would, I would have to mail them the, the yeah. product. And then, which which alone is, was a few hundred dollars, right? Because they opened the product. And then and then, then they charged me like another $500. Then they sent me the images and I don't know, I told them to keep the product or whatever. So it was a pain in the neck and it took around a week. Yes. Um, let's show me how um, how it works, please. Yeah, I'll share my screen. Um, so it's super simple. Um, basically, you take your product. I'll use this um, this um, this dog food as an example product. We've got a couple of advanced settings here. Um, the first the first one is like two AI modes you've trained. You can resize your output product in the the image. I'm just going to move it slightly to the left. And then, Ed, what's your favorite um, dog? What's my favorite dog? Um, Golden Retriever. I'm not crazy about dogs, but all right. And the people from Amazon, when they, when they say I'm not crazy about dogs, they're not going to like that. But... They love the dogs. Yeah, so... I think more, more than the people, but OK. <laughs> Well, I can say that, yeah. Um, so then you basically interact with this AI like using natural language prompting, like you would for Chat GPT. I'm sure your 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 you know your sellers are very familiar. You um we have done some work on like how to prompt the best, and we have a guide here. But basically, you like say how you want your product to interact with your scene, you write that in natural language text, and then in, in seconds, right, you're gonna have generated these beautiful, beautiful lifestyle images. Um I mean, this one's pretty, this one here is pretty, um, pretty amazing. And um, this is not a real dog. This has been generated by AI. Um, it, it didn't exist. What's happened here is it's brought together the prompt, the product, um, and the training data and kind of mesh, which is, uh, you know, we fine-tuned uh, models specifically for Amazon conversion uh, with, with images we purchase and brought that together to create a beautiful, beautiful output. And I can... I can quickly show as well the, the other tool we launched, um, which is helping you to create um, beautiful infographics, um, which is coming. How, how, I mean, how, how do you charge for that? Because that, that was amazing. So we, we, our packages range from $95 a month to $165 a month. $165 a month include every, all the tools, infographics and listings. $95 is just the... Um, it's just the images and 135 is images and infographics. So we kind of charge um, charge like that. And we we have kind of like different stages of um, how many products you can do it for, but it's an unlimited like per product. So you could generate 
literally an infinite number of, I wasn't doing now, but you could generate an infinite number of lifestyle images on our tour, infinite number of prompts. Um, for $95, I mean, it's very cheap. You can have unlimited, unlimited, yeah. wow. So just to show you the this one, so I'll take a, I, you can choose from our like range of um, infographics here. I'll just choose a new one just to be interesting. Um, I'm just gonna bring this one in. You would put in your product description, like, and then maybe I can talk about the bullet points I'll say for adult dog. Don't, I wanna spell this correctly. Um, best for bone health. I don't know what else is good. Um, turkey, meat, um, 100%. I mean, well, from what I can see, you can't, I mean, if you don't have this, you can't compete, because why would you spend, is this bad for photography, for, for photographers? I think so. <laughs> well, here we go. We've just, it's, well, it's bad, if it's bad for photographers, it's also bad for graphic designers, because we've just kind of AI generated this um, in, in seconds, as you saw this, this infographic um, with, with your product. Um, and all of this is fully, fully changeable. But, I think like if you want to get into this like philosophical discussion on photographers, what I would say is like at the launch of the camera, uh, right, um, pretty famous philosophers were saying, um, oh, this is going to be the end for artists, for, uh, for, gra uh, for um, illustrators, because if you imagine beforehand, in, like the Victorian times, you'd always have like illustrated um, kind of things and all the adverts in the newspapers. And people saying, oh, it's the end of um, uh, illustrating, it's so bad, it's mechanical, it's going to destroy art. And fast forward, you know, 70 years, what's actually happened to the illustrators is we have uh, more than ever, I think there's like 30,000 illustrators in the US. And, um, you know, they have one of the highest job satisfactions out of all careers. And what they're doing is busy making Pixar movies and, and Disney movies and this kind of stuff. So I think it's like, in my opinion, like technology is an enabler. This is like an amazing co-pilot for Amazon sellers. Perhaps you weren't able to optimize only 10% of your listings now. Now with this tool, you can optimize all of them, right? You could you could optimize all of them. You could refresh it for the business for New Year's. I'll show you, I'll show you the, um, the, the this one as well. You can like optimize your listings across the different languages. I'll just put in the same stuff here just to, just to show you people. Um, so, like, I think this is like the ultimate co-pilot for Amazon sellers, and I don't. I think this is job creating, not not job destroying. Like, who knows what will happen to photographers? But like, all of these models are trained on images, photography, right? So, like, we're going to need like, and there's going to be tons of them. Like, we built specifically for for Amazon, but like, everyone's going to be building for for their specific use cases, and we're going to need we're going to need data to feed them. So, I I don't think that is is the case necessarily. Just the listing, it's amazing. The whole thing is amazing. I mean, uh, but the, the, the images were like, I mean, that's like next level. I mean, that's incredible. Yeah, thank you. Yeah, it's, um, it's like, we, we're like I'm, I'm super proud. One of the big issues we've had in, in AI is like accurately representing the product in generated images. And that's what we've trained this precise mode to do. So you will not have any hallucinations. You will not have any like weird kind of, things that you'd have if you did it in like a mid journey or something like this like it's completely accurate um representation of your product and therefore like you know uh, uh, you know usable in, in in that sense um so yeah so that, 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 this, that was amazing and and i'm saying are you giving some you have some kind of discount with the link you generated we or? do we do i think we have a link i think it's um and i'm dyslexic so i'm going to get this wrong a s g t g 15 is that is that is that have I got yeah? I mean, I'll right? put I'll, I'll put the link under the video, and it's a fifteen percent discount. Yes, fifteen percent discount with um, with that code. Yes. Okay. Okay, that was fascinating, and lots of luck, and um, hopefully come to the event January again. Okay? I would I would love to be there again. I'd honestly love to be there again. It was great fun. Okay, thank you so much. I appreciate it. Thank you. Thank you. Bye.